Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I am going to be setting up my Heidi swap and taking things out of here. My recollections. So before I begin, I'd like to tell everybody welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So this here is super chunky. So hopefully it'll work in here. So yeah, let's begin. I'm going to start in the middle because I think that is best. As chunky as this is, I'm not going to be able to go in the front and do it. Uh, let me fix these little books real quick. Okay, so this is a Heidi Swap. It's a personal planner. It looks like it's glittered, but it's not. I actually love the material. Is what it looks like. Why does it look so dark? Why does my room look so dark? Okay, so yeah, I don't know why it's picking up so dark. But it's gorgeous and it's a nice smooth feel. And snap closure. And we're going to be taking the guts out of here because I'm not going to need them. I actually got this planner for $13.97. So this will be my new faith book. Um, I don't know how long I will be in here. Depending on how chunky I could get it. No, I'm just kidding. So that's what it looks like. Without all the inserts, you have three pockets, a pocket here. There is no pocket here. I will probably add a pocket here. And then it's gold rings, gold hardware. I will keep some of the acetate that's in here. So we'll leave this here. So again, we're going to start from probably the middle. I have these my liners that I have to find a spot for. Okay, let's see. So we are going to start with the prayer section. And I will do a flip after I am done. So let me move that out the way so you can see how I am doing this. I need a bigger tripod or bigger camera. So I'm just taking acetate with me or vellum. This came from Dollar Tree. It's a list pad. And I just wrote what colors mean to me. So when I'm in the Bible, it's yellow is prayer, green is scripture, red is soap. I don't know why, but that's what I did. Um, the Promise Bible book. Should be... This is actually prayer, so I put this in prayer. Positive thinking, okay. The only thing about Heidi Swap is you have to open and close them. But I slice them so... So this is from the uh, Bible Promise book, which is this one here. I wonder if I could acetate it back here. I've seen that on Joy to Plan. And then have it back here somehow. So we'll see. But that is the book, Joy. Uh, the Bible Promise book I got from Dollar Tree. This is a pocket that just has stickers. This is Recollections, and this is from, oh my god. I can't think where this is from, but these are just Faith stickers. And then I want to start Affirmations, um, you know, in this section. I keep saying I will, and I don't. The next is just from Our Daily Bread, and I just have this little girl. And a resin you is the one that you know does these little girls and puts them in there. So I shrunk mine down, and yeah, so that's that. I did a Bible study plan, so these are the ones that are done, and now I have to put the new one. And then four simple steps for spiritual discipline. 
I don't know if I show this yet. The reasons the church exists, understand why it is so important. There's three reasons. A few principles that will help you enjoy a consistent and rich prayer life. Let's continue. Many types of prayers and looking up scriptures. So these are the ones I want to look up. Speak, declare, confess God's word, and look up spiritual uh, maturity. Because that was in one of the Bible studies. So that is that. The next section is kind of random. So this section has my gratitude, my to do, uh, today's focus, a faith to do list, and I just put gratitude up here. And then what I am grateful for. And then prayer. I like to do Psalms of prayer. And then in the, this is what it looks like. I'm trying to find a blank one. But I think I got sticker happy. Yeah, I got sticker happy. And then the next section is the soap study. Oh, why aren't you going down? Okay, there you go. I already feel this being chunky, and it's not even the beginning. It's not in the beginnings. It's not even, I mean, in the middle stages yet. So those are soap studies. I'm going to take this one out because it's kind of big. Okay. Let's see. See what I'm saying? Like, we're already halfway. This is scripture, and I've started doing um, for a month anxiety. So that is that. And I just have some extra sheets on it. Got those from Recollections. Then I have God's Timing. And I will do a flip of all of this at the end. You've seen this one already. Okay, so now I'm going to go back into the front. Uh, I don't know. It's looking a little packed already. And I need to come out of here. This is just an acetate I got. Some sticky notes from the Target Dollar Spot. And then some things I needed to do. And then just a little thing I made, which I'll show you. Hello Today bookmark. This I made out of a paper from Michael's, stick lettered paper. I've made that pen loop a long time ago. It has a highlighter, and then this I just got off of, uh, no, this was Joyce Myers. And that just sits perfectly in there. <coughs> Excuse me. This is my faith. So this is all like my scriptures that I'll be doing. This one I'm already doing. So I'm already on this side. I only got three more days left. This goes into another planner once it's done. So this whole section is pretty much scripture. And again, I will do a flip once I am done. Depending on how long this video is, because this is a lot. The next one is just more scripture and a lot of fun stuff. Jesus Christ, main heading, things like that. I love when all the paper line up and it's so much easier to put in here. Okay, then we, the next section we go into topical Bible study. Let's see, how's this working out so far? So this is almost everything and it's looking pretty good. I doubt it closes, to be honest with you, it's not going to close. Maybe if I took the pen out, let's see, or the highlighter. Okay, so it does close without the highlighter, but I have to have my highlighter. 
So we're going to go into the back. Wow, we are chunky. I don't know why they don't have those things. So like I said, the next one is Topical Bible Studies. But before I put that, I have to put the stuff from the back. And I am not taking everything out from the back, so I'm just going to take some stuff. So, of course, I'll use a pocket. This sticker came from Joyce Myers, so I put that there. And it's the um, Agenda 52 line. This is just the trigger list if I want to do planning up in here, which I don't know why. This section here is just a to buy list. Uh, I can't do it with one hand. I'm holding the paper in one hand and trying to grab from the other. Yeah, not multitasking very well. So this is things I need in the house. I put it in here. I don't know why. A cute little acetate. Er, not an acetate. Laminate sheet that I made. I just threw some confetti down. Here. Hopefully this holds up very well because the recollections, I love the recollections. For the price you're paying, the recollections is really good to hold up. This is my devotional section. This I just made out of a cutting mat from Dollar Tree and I just put stickers. Those Dollar Tree cutting mats could go a long way. Okay, so now we have just the topical Bible study to put in here. And we should be all set to go. And I didn't take that much out. Just some of the soap studies. And I don't know what it is, but I have to carry, like, everything with me. I don't know why. Like, I have to have everything in my planner. And this is my faith faith book so I'm just fixing the pages so that when I able to close it they're easier to turn this is how chunky it is without deco and you've seen the front of my recollections so yeah I doubt it will you know even close this my recollection stopped closing a long time ago so let's go into the front I may go in and clean it up a little bit but kind of like it. Let's put this pen. Oh, well, wait. Can't do it with one hand. I don't know why. So these I got from Michael's Good Vibes and Work Smart. I don't know. I like it here. So I just put them in the pocket. Um, the next things I have are Say Grace. And this is just some laminated sheet with some washi tape. Well, it gets six out. One of the girls on YouTube did this and put my name, but I have like a little mini printer. So I just printed that out and I just have it peeking out. Um, sticky notes. Very pretty colors, so that's why I keep that there. Um, little cross sticker. It's one of those dimensional. I tried to get the dimension out, but it just wasn't working. So I'll just put it across there. Some more washi tape. It is on a deck of cards. Um, but it's just easier to hold, you know, with you. This one here is just so cute. I made that one off what was left of an acetate. I try not to throw anything away. I'm such a hoarder. And what else? I think that's all I'm going to take out of there. So we're pretty much, I left this stuff here. And what is in the back of here? So this is what adds my bulk, like a lot of my bulk. Okay. Let's see, oh, my little computer. I don't think that's gonna work. I'm gonna leave it out. I have more sticky notes I'm gonna leave out. I have another bookmark. Uh, some more washi tape, more sticky notes, and acetate to put back here. 
Yeah, I might just leave the acetate and then more sticky notes. So this stuff I'm going to leave out. I'll probably just put it back into the recollections so it's already set up. Or at least some stuff is set up. I do want this. Okay. So there is my recollections. Oh, I'm going to so miss it. Not that it's going anywhere. It's just going to be, you know, put away for now. Just to reserve it, you know. I don't want it to break because of how chunky it is. So let's do a quick flip. I'm not really into, like, the decorating part of it. So, yeah. I just like having a little bit of stuff here. Um, the book will just stay in the front for now. Until I can figure out the back. So again, acetate just with some sticky notes. This I created, and you can see it's already popping out because it's so chunky. Hello today. This thing just you just put them anywhere. It's a pen loop holder. I just leave it in the front. Again, scripture is in the front. So you have like protection. This is what we're doing here which I have not been keeping up with. I have to. I have been keeping up with it, but it's not in this planner. But this is the protection one I'm doing for June. And I'm already on... Oh my God, what day are we on? Where is... Uh, let me grab my book so I can see and mark it off. Okay, so in the back here... Here's protection. We're already on day 12. So I am caught up. I just have not caught up in marking those off. If that makes sense. So I'll do that after the video. But I am caught up in my scripture writing. Then we have balance. These are the ones I already showed you. Dealing with depression. Oh, it flows better. I don't know why. Um, to pray couple of them healing you know I like this this says never stop praying this a lot of these I already showed none of these are new not yet once I get done with a lot of these then I will start more new ones like adding new stuff into here because obviously you see it is pretty chunky hope I have two hope ones peace praise I've showed this. Still have not put the colors in yet. So here, color coding, note to self. So looking up is one of my goals, working on getting my soul healthy. God's voice, Satan's voice, I've showed that. Hope again. Uncertainty. Uh, I praise you for when you have promised. Trust. There is more that I want to look up. I have a little post-it note next to me. And I got this from Walgreens a long time ago. It was like a quarter. It has tons of sticky notes in here. And different colors. So the ones I want to look up is Forgiveness, Righteous, Sabbath, Parables, and, and Inner Purity, and Farce. So those are the ones I want to look up. Scriptures can you can pray. So I got a bunch of those. I should put the prayer into the one. I may go and clean this out because like this one should be in the prayer one and not in the scripture one. So I'll take that out. So here's yes I'm a Christian, yes I make mistakes, yes I fall and stumble, yes I struggle, yes I'm a mess, but I'm God's mess. And God can turn a mess into a masterpiece. Love that. And then I'll put something in the back. So this is, again, prayer journal ideas. So we can take this out. Anger. Jesus Christ. Main heading. 12 fruits of the Holy Spirit. This I did is just a tip in. Probably have to rewash it. 12 fruits. 12 Fruits of the Holy Spirit, Faith, Beautiful Day, From Hurting to Healing, The World Again, 
Um, this is the Apple uh, study, the Bible study method. This here is Jesus' main heading, and it's just a lot of different things I'll get into in another video because there's a lot. As you can see, it just keeps going. And this is where it stops. And then I put do not fear. And then this is something that was on Pinterest. And the videos that I want to watch, like the YouTube people that I want to watch, is Daily Grace Co. Uh, the idea method. So that's another method. Just a pretty acetate. And I like it's backed on the vellum. It's a pretty vellum. I showed you this. Psalms to help calm anxiety and prayer. So this is the prayer one. And then five reasons praying. The Psalms daily will transform your prayers. I just highlight it. My next section, again, is the Bible Promise book. So if you're looking up any words you wanted to, for acceptance, aging, angels, things like that, it's in the Bible Promise book. This little tab. Daily affirmations. Positive thinking. Healing prayer, another one. I just ripped that page. It was open. Why didn't it? Oh, it was already. It was sliced. See? I don't know why I did that. Okay, so that's that. I showed you that. Daily affirmations I showed you. Positive thinking. Again, the pocket. And it just has, like, a lot of to-do list which I have to add to, and then just a bunch of random stickers I cut down. Some little stickers from the Happy Planner. So that I have on the one that says the 12 Fruits of the Spirit. I have this for prayer. It says pray. Salt. And then God's Love. So that I just throw in here, and then another sticker. And I just like it peeking out. Okay, and then this is our daily bread. I get a bunch of these in the mail. Again, the girl cut down. This is new. This is the Bible study plan I showed you um, when I was first putting this in here. So I have to put the new one that's that I'm working on. And then every plan that I do, I will mark off. I should put the date I've got it done or the date I started it. But I have not did that. Maybe next time. And then I showed you this. The four simple steps. Spiritual discipline of repentance and receive God's forgiveness. This section is, again, the gratitude. Today's focus. Faith to-do list. And then my prayer. So that's this whole section. Then we get into the soap study. So this is what I'm focusing on. These are from when I do my Bible studies, faith, and how to pray. So that is the Faith That Overcomes book. And then every time they give you a scripture, I write it down. And then when I'm ready to do my soap study on it that I do a soap study only when I feel the need to so this is my whole section of soap study this is what it looks like blank the next section is my scripture writing so I do do scripture writing in here I do scripture writing in here and I do scripture writing in other books as well so yeah, so this is my little section for scripture writing. There's not a lot of room to write in here because the paper, I mean, it's a personal size. So that's why I tend to like the bigger books on that. So I just have extra blank paper. The next one is Enjoy the Journey. And I don't know why I have the goals in here and ideas, but maybe one day I'll use it. The next one is scripture, and I don't know why it's in here because this is all for scripture. 
And then I have topical studies. So any word you could think of is probably up in here. <clears throat> in alphabetical order. And then it has it by like the church. That let me show you real quick. So this one here, I already did anxiety. So that one's done. So topical Bible study start here. So here's afterlife, and then you know. When you see it highlighted, that means it's done. Anxiety was a big one. Like, it has a lot. Anxiety has a lot to do with, you know, a lot of things you can study. Uh, what else? <clears throat> if that made any sense. Like, anxiety. If you type in the word anxiety, Bible studies, a lot comes up for that. Church. I think I just said that. Um, is this one, another one? Yeah, Doctrine and Theology. This continues. End Times, God. And you'll see they're highlighted in a sticker to show the title. Holy Spirit, Jesus. See, that's what I'm talking about. Um, Old Testament. Relationships. Scripture. And spiritual beings. And then this is bravery. So this is a scripture writing on bravery. So a lot of this is supposed to be in the front. And then this is moments of worship. My identity in Christ. Um, what else? Learning about characters. About character traits. And then... Another topical study idea. Ideas for character Bible study. Anything highlighted means like Jonathan, son of Saul's son. Uh, no, I'm sorry. Son of Saul. I'm reading it like if it was going down. Joseph, son of Rachel and Jacob. Joshua, son of Nun. Um, Ezekiel, king of Judah. So things like that. So there's the men, and then there's the section is the woman, and again it's highlighted to say like Mary is Martha's sister, Paul Saul of Taurus. So then here's just like a little pretty bookmark I made. Ooh, 27 minutes in. And the next section is my devotional section, which is the faith that overcomes. Oh no, I'm sorry. The healing of a woman devotional. Healing the soul of a woman devotional. It's early in the morning. I cannot talk. And then that is it. The quarantine. And everything else I showed you already. So this is just a quick flip. I'm not going to even put those acetates in here because there wouldn't be no sense. This is not going to close as it is. So, like, once a month, or at least not once a month, like, probably every week I go in. Yeah, I would think it's weekly because I've been taking a lot of stuff out. So, like, this whole section will come out. This is all done. I will leave this last page here. But this whole section will come out. And then when I do my scripture, which I've been pulling out, you know, quite a bit, I will go ahead and remove this. This, I, I do not like when it wastes paper. So what I've been doing is doing two on one, as you can see. I like when this is slit. You can do this. You don't have to open up the binder. So the planner. So yeah. So this is a quick flip through. I will go more deeper into my lists in another video. Um... That was requested. Um, I believe her handle is uh, Joy to Plan. And I will, you know, try to link her Instagram because she's on Instagram. She needs to do a YouTube video. I think she has so many great ideas. I'm going to link her Instagram so you can, you know, watch her on Instagram and yeah but she has so many great ideas on her planners 
and she gets, you know, you can get a lot of useful information from her as well and how she does her stuff. So again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a comment and share the video. That'd be great. I appreciate it. So I went ahead and put my two my aligners. I like the pink and the blue. And then I just have a pink one. And this one I can just move into any section. But for some reason, I just like it in the front. Now let's see if the moment of truth not even close even with the mile liners in here not even close to closing it but I leave it open anyway on my desk so one day I'll be able to close it because you know these sections will come out I'll do an in-depth study you know like a, a deeper flip through of the topical Bible studies and of the lists that I will have in here and then um, more of the scripture writing stuff so I may take a lot of the scripture writing out because you, there's only so much scripture writing you could do um yeah so maybe this whole section will come out and I'll just leave a little bit in here we'll see because I hate taking stuff out of my planners this will just go into another planner maybe I'll just put it in the one that I just had Oh, I'm going to use this one. No, I'll just use it in the one I have. Uh, we'll put it in here for now. Hopefully I remember these are in here. These inserts are the Heidi Swap inserts that just came out of there. And then this is the Happy Planner Soap Study. So this, there, this one is actually the Scripture, Observation, Application, and Prayer. So, yeah, so thank you for watching. I'm just going to go ahead and put these in here, which is just going to be real quick. And please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell. I will uh, post her information so you can go watch her. She does a lot of stories on Instagram. Really nice lady. And, yeah, I will talk to you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye-bye. For relief, look at how cute that is. That's a cute divider. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.